Project Manager Tom Hoffman, Insight Principal and, and Elizabeth Barrett, the Insight Instrument Operations Lead. To start, uh, I want everybody here to know that um, I've been on the phone recently with both the President and the Vice President, and they are overwhelmingly proud of everything that has gone on here today. I'd like to to the inside of Mars itself, JPL. Uh, it was really something. Got some goosebumps down here watching the coverage. The day is coming where we land humans on Mars. We're very excited about that. I think that's why our astronauts are so excited about it and why they wanted to congratulate everybody here. You can see the, the, we can see the surface of Mars and um, I'm, just, I'm just taking... Working for seven years, as many of the people here in the room have done, to get to the point where you have seven more minutes to survive, <laughs> literally survive, uh, is incredibly hard to describe. My heart was basically, I think, just stopped beating for seven minutes. I don't know if that's healthy or not, but uh, but then when we, we got the indication of parachute deployment, which was an absolutely terrifying thing to think about, we got that positive, and then listening to Christine Soleil call out as we got closer and closer to the surface, every time she made a call out, you know, the hairs on the back of my neck would start rising a little bit higher, a little bit higher. And then when we finally got the confirmation of touchdown, it was completely amazing. We can basically use Mars as a time machine to go back and look at what the Earth must have looked like a few tens of millions of years after it formed. And by doing that, we can then look at our, our physical models, our, our theories of how the Earth evolved and understand why the Earth became the way it is.